Hello everyone, it's Lottie from Cancer is a Lifestyle. So today we have an Aldi haul. I actually <laughs> went in for two items and came out with all of this. So, <laughs> But Aldi is a store that I normally do not go shopping in. Like I said, when we were in a city, we basically went to a vegetable market and Costco. And these were the two stores that we kind of hung out in. Um, Aldi was just somewhere that we went to get like tuna or um, some canned goods once in a while. But otherwise, I find myself really liking the store. I don't know if I maybe I never really looked at it before the way I did today. Or maybe they have... Um, improve their stock or something but i really loved the store i went through every aisle and i really loved what i saw and i'm really seriously thinking of maybe even making this my permanent store so that's quite big <laughs> but i think aldi has really come a long way since they first opened so i did pick up two taco shells we used those for our fish tacos um, and I also needed to get some pastas to fill up for my uh, winter prepping that I like to do in my pantry. So I got two of the spaghettis. I think they were going for like 99 cents each, which is so far the cheapest that I have seen. And then I have, uh, I got one box of the macaroni. Um, I did uh, kind of regret not getting another one. It was a dollar or something for these, but it's a pretty big box. I think it's what, how many? It's 32, yeah, it's two pounds. And I did go looking for tea. That was my main um, objective in going to all these. I was a little disappointed. They did not have much of a selection. These, uh, um, I did pick up the peppermint, the calomel green tea, and then the green tea um, lemon and ginseng. I wish they had more of a selection, even though, um, I bought, uh, the three pack at Sam's club the other day, but we go through a lot of tea, you guys, and I would love to stock up on it. And, uh, and also, you know, pricing is important too, because tea is expensive. You guys, I did pick up two cans of, uh, cranberry sauce, uh, kind of just, uh, we don't make this a habit, but you know, once in a while, it's nice to have cranberry sauce with, with mashed potatoes. And I did pick up some pretzels. These are the honey wheat flavoring. These are smaller. Uh, we have been looking for different uh, snacks that maybe are not as high calorie, uh, but still fulfilling and uh, kind of stay away from the sweet stuff. And pretzels seem to do a trick. Uh, we did also... I did pick up some broccoli. Now, this is probably the first time I picked up broccoli all summer, you guys. I don't know if the broccoli had a bad year this year, but it just seems so overpriced to me in the stores. And um, But this one was a little better. I think it was a dollar something. I don't remember the exact price. But otherwise, it, maybe broccoli did not have a really good year this year. But my first time this summer, for sure. Definitely need more bananas. We can never have enough bananas. We go through bananas here like people drink water. And I did pick up two avocados. These are a nice size. We also make, uh, we love to stuff the avocados with some tuna. So my daughter did do a video. If you look in the food section in my playlist, um, cooking section, she didn't do a, a whole uh, kind of a, recipe and how we make our stuffed avocados with the tuna salad those are really good if you guys never tried tuna and avocado together you should definitely try though that is a great marriage together and the main other reason that i came besides the tea was the tuna i wanted to get a whole case of it if i could i was very embarrassed in getting this whole section i had to control myself and I did pick up, I think there were, how many are in here? Uh, it's three stacks high. So it's what, uh, let me see, three, six, nine, twelve. Is there like twelve of them in? No, it's not twelve. Three, six, nine, eighteen, uh, twenty-seven, thirty. I got thirty cans. Hopefully this will last us for a while. We love tuna. We use it for a lot of recipes. One of them, like I said, with our stuffed avocado, 
we also like to have it over salad it's just a quick uh, meal that we like to make on those random days that you know you get behind and you don't have much time to really sit there and prepare a big meal we enjoy the tuna over the salad or like you know just uh, simply in a stuffed avocado um, and it's also a light meal if sometimes you just you know you've been overeating and you want something light we love our tuna so anyway that's about all i have today you guys i hope you have a wonderful day and if you've never been to aldi which i'm very surprised if you guys haven't i hope you check them out so have a great day guys bye